All right, on to developments now from the world of a technology. We're starting with TikTok that is taking steps to now ensure transparency. The platform will now use content credentials, which is a digital watermark to indicate how images and videos were created and edited. The ByteDance owner owned app aims to address concerns about misinformation and disinformation on its platform. The idea is to prevent AI generated content from being misused, particularly in the context of the upcoming US elections. The content credentials software has been developed by Adobe. The tech has been adopted by other companies as well, including ChatGPT, Creator, OpenAI. To activate this system, both the AI tool creator and the platform must agree to the industry standard. For instance, images generated by OpenAI's Doll E tool will be marked and when uploaded to TikTok, they'll be labeled as AI generated. This move extends TikTok's existing labeling of AI generated content to include a content created outside the platform as well. Meta's oversight board has upheld a decision to remove two Facebook posts. The posts in question urged Australians to vote multiple times in an indigenous rights referendum. The posts failed to mention that voting multiple times is an offence in Australia. At the time, Meta proactively identified the posts and sent it for human review. The social media platform eventually removed the two posts before Australia's Indigenous Rights Referendum was put to vote in October 2023. The board said in its ruling that while both the account holders were engaged in a heated political debate, that did not give them the right to call for others to engage in illegal behaviour. Meta added that multiple votes could have impacted the rights of others, particularly the right to vote. The decision comes amidst the Australian government's plans to introduce penalties for internet platforms which fail to rein in misinformation and disinformation. A team of US researchers have unveiled a new AI tool capable of instantly predicting suicidal thoughts and behaviours. The tool employs a simple picture ranking task alongside demographic factors and according to its makers, it's, it boasted an accuracy of 92%. As per researchers, the tool's ability to quantify reward and aversion judgments offers deep insights into human preference behavior. Researchers claim the AI tool can prove to be a useful technology, highlighting its potential in aiding medical professionals, hospitals and the military to identify individuals most at risk of self-harm. As part of the research, the team surveyed over 4,000 American citizens aged between 18 to 70. It was found that the software was able to predict various levels of suicidal tendencies among its users.